He makes dumb jokes while he shoots his gun. Major Slack is lots of fun. Major Slack attack. Hey, wait a minute. There's no guns in this game. Shut up, Pee Wee. Hey, the name is Slack. Thanks for coming back. Let's walk this more Skyrim Pure Red Guard Challenge. We are playing through the game using only the Red Guard skills. One handed, smithing, block, archery, destruction, and alteration. And I would show you the, uh, the skill tree, but I can't because I don't want to level up. Um, what we want to do is, uh, watch it now. Jeez, okay. And <laughs> just jump off a cliff. I don't have to pump my luck. What I want to do is hustle up uh, enough scratch to buy four um, rounds of block skill training. And then we can level up. And then we'll go on a skilled archery skill book run if we can finally get archery up to 80. But I've got these four skill training purchase rights that I don't want to waste. Which we're going to waste as soon as we level up. This is the little... Uh, caper that I had planned earlier. All these potions here, we could quickly steal them even if she sees us. She'll probably go hostile and then we could just go outside, talk to a guard and get him to absolve us, pardon us because we are Thane of Whiterun. You'll so um, salves, poultices, and let me just see that I can get away with this. Browse to your heart's content. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing? By the order of the yard. I command you to hold. By the order of the yard. Here we go. Stop right there. Okay, calm down. I am the Jarl's Thane. I demand that you let me go at once. Oh, forgive me, Thane. I didn't realize it was you. <laughs> look the other way this time. But even the Jarl's influence has its limits. If there's anything Be more I can careful. help you with, you have but to ask. Okay, and he lets you go, and he even lets you keep the stolen goods. Oh, I missed one. I missed this one. Dang it. It's only worth 36. Could be a tax Pick all the other ones. It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. All right, so that went relatively well. Let's go sell these off at the Thieves Guild. Also, the um, the Thieves Guild caches should have respawned by now. Let's go do get those first. Starting off at Missville Keep. And there's another thief here, so we can loot him and get some loot off him. And this will bring our gold supply up. We're shooting for around 1600, 1700. Should be enough for four rounds of block skill training. So you got a thief here, eh? Where's the thief? That guard is shooting that way, so he must be over here. Maybe we can help him out. Yeah, give it up. I love these thieves in Rift and they all say, I yield, they yield, and they keep running. Okay, we got him cornered. Should be able to finish him off. We're back. He's not even close to being dead. I'm trying to get a shot at him without, like, you know. Best you can do. Victory is yours. I submit. And I don't believe you have Kai's token on. Looks like everybody else gave up and they just, you know, it's up to me now. Come on, get down that shit there. Bunch of lazy arse rifting guards. Kill him. Yeah. There we go. Okay. A couple diamonds. Okay, that was worth it. And an emerald. Okay, that was definitely worth it. Um, the old woman who runs the orphanage has been murdered. Yeah, you don't say, eh? Say, didn't I see you coming out? No, no, it had nothing to do with me. <clears throat> okay, Thieves Guild cash run. Starting here at the Missville Barracks. Go upstairs. 
on the balcony. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Excellent. Next one is down here. And the final one is back here. Let's sell out those stolen potions. Did your yeah, tomatoes respawn? Do you want? No, they did not. Kill gear. Yeah, we're just here, so nothing's respawned yet. All eyes are on you, lass. Welcome to the. Don't disappoint us. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Potion of haggling. I'm probably better off just like Until next time. using this. If you're looking for extra I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. Just selling everything stolen. Okay, and she still has money. Great, we got plenty for another round of skill training. Mission accomplished. Awesome. Carry what is respectable. Okay, so we're gonna buy block skill training, so that would be the warrior stone. So we'll hook up the warrior stone, then go get well rested. And then buy some block skill training. Then we can level up, then we can go on an archery skill book run. Now you know exactly where they all are. Okay, starting with the warrior stone. Major business here, major, major business. Major business with major slack. I know a lot of you like business. Some of you do not. I did do, oh. Because some people were like, were bitching um, that I did too, too much business. It just turned out to be a, a small minority. Like a really tiny, tiny minority because I did do a Skyrim run where there was no business, no crafting and no purchases. Try to remember to put a link to that in the video description or in a post, in a pinned comment. And it turned out to be one of my least popular challenge runs. Seems that everybody wants a good dose of business mixed in with their Skyrim runs. So yeah, the the no business run, not very popular. Not very popular at all. Really took me by surprise. Okay, so we want to hook up with Nyada. Who will be in bed around midnight? So let's just wait till midnight. Rest till midnight. Bring to our youth today's come and gone. For the age of aggression is just about done. Just goes to show you something I've learned over my years working on YouTube. Those who yell the loudest in the comments are not necessarily representative of the general consensus. Not at all.
There she is right there. Good. Nyada. I'm still trying to figure out why Skior let you in in the first. Can you I train can. me to block? It might save your life. Okay, four times, please. There we go. Perfect. Now we can safely level up. Points it to magic, definitely. We have a perk point. We're gonna save that, definitely for um, overdraw five when we get our tree up to eighty. Let's go on a skill book run. First skill book's right here in White Run. White Run, rather. At the Drunken Huntsman. What? Wait a minute. I work for Bellathor at the General Goods Store. Here's the Drunken Huntsman. This guy's open all night. And the skill book is behind the counter. Right here. Just read it, don't steal it. There we go, I should up to 76. Next. Froki's Shack. <laughs> There's another skill book here in White Run. Um, but it will require uh, the Tower of Stone. Let's do this first. Okay, back to White Run. Now that we have the Tower Stone hooked up, what else can we steal? <laughs> um, oh, I know something we can do. We can go grab those silver ingots up at the Jarl's, uh, up at Dragon's Reach. Just kick in turbo power here. Okay, we're here back at the companions. We're gonna loot Ayala's room. She's got a a locked display case in her room with an archery skill book and a bow. And she's not home. Great. Let's shut the door. Quick save. Unlock. Yoink. Let's take that. And it's a elbow bow, yoink, and we're out of here. Oh well. Might as well just grab everything else. Give me that. Whoop! Is she coming? Okay. <laughs> oh, let's grab that and that. Oh, that'll be useful. And the money. And Ayala, let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. <laughs> He's got a million of them. He's here all week, folks. Don't forget to tip your waitress. Okay, so we're out of here. Next. Mr. Laptop says, hook up the thief stone. Never argue with Mr. Laptop. He's going to do it. I can't remember why, uh, but yeah. Yes, I've learned. Don't argue with Mr. Laptop. There's I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Oh, yeah, for sure. Thief stone. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, so yeah, definitely hook up the thief stone. Um, Froki's shack. Just in case we run into any um, combat, we'll have the thief stone. We'll be leveling up our tree. 
even more. And yep, yeah, there's a dragon here, just as I thought. Froki Shack has an archery skill book that we left earlier on. Hey kid, how you doing? Doing okay there? I'm eleven years old and I could take you. Really now? Cause um we murdered your dad. Someday <laughs> I'm gonna kill a dragon all by myself. Presuming that was your dad. And might as well steal that, he's not gonna say anything. That's probably not his dad. Alright, so. Archery up to 78. One last skill book. And then we'll have to take it the rest of the way to 80 manually. This skill book is at a place called Hunter's Rest. It's kind of a little known location. Just south of Jukar's Monument. It's right about, boom, here. So let's go to Jukar's Monument and ride south. And there's a dragon here. Wait a minute. Nope. Let's get that chump loot. Looks like a high shield. down to the marker. Okay, eventually find the road. Okay, once you find this road going south, go up the hill. And you can see, see it just popped up on the compass. The little house icon. That's where we're going. Hunter's Rest. Right here. Can you get up there, Thunder? Come on, up you go. Up you go. Attaboy. Right here. And the skill book is right there. Hmm. Some good venison in here. Yoink, yoink. steal some cabbage and 51 gold yike we're good okay so that's it for the skill book run got quite a ways to go for um archery 80 Oh yeah, we have this uh, quest to go to Redoran's Retreat. Let's do that. And get Amran's Sword. To clear that, that'll level up our tree. Because there's a tough badass bandit in there. Swindler's Den? Nope. Redoran's Retreat. I believe I have a new set of downs. Yes, I got a new set of skill training purchase rates. Probably gonna have to blow that away. Okay. It's paralysis rune bow time. Let's make sure we got the right gear on. Yep.
Here we go, let's trade shots. Let's see our bullets doing a lot more damage. Okay, the tougher bandits are back here. Let's try not to draw out the bandit chief. Let's try to get the outlaw to come out by himself. Easy, easy, easy. Should be passing by right what was there. That? He is. Time to end this little game. Okay, hopefully he just got the outlaw. Yep. Okay, great. Say hello to my little friend, dude. <laughs> Uh, no, you don't. <laughs> ah. Give it up. I would love to get archery to eighty before. Yeah, this should happen. Before leveling up. Okay, this is going to get a little tricky because this bandit chief is going to be tough. Tough hungry. It's a quick save. <laughs> Gotta love it, eh? <laughs> Real tough, Hombre. He's gonna take a lot of shots. This is good though, this is exactly what we want. Wanna level up archery. There you go, pop goes the weasel. They really fly, eh? <laughs> Gotta love that paralysis rune. Uh-oh. Okay. And this is the situation. Party's over. Dude! <laughs> Up goes the weasel! And we're gonna have to run for it until their magicka regenerates. That should be enough. He can one shot us potentially. There you go. No, alteration went out. Okay, because I have to start using some poisons because I'm running out of magicka. And I think he's going to catch me with my pants down. So let's use this one. Dude! That's just hilarious. Uh, where is he? Shit. Hmm? Knew that was going to happen. See? Legendary is no fucking joke. It's no fucking joke. Okay, here we go again. I was playing a little too close to the edge there. Um, Frostbite Venom, are you... Yes, you're hotkeyed. And yeah, this is what I was doing in practice runs. I don't know why I abandoned this strategy. I was trying to get away with it without using up all these... Uh... Yep, so... Poison with Frostbite Venom each time.
I'm done for. Let me get out of here. No! Fuck! I got stuck! Don't come out, don't come out, don't come out, don't come out. Go! Whew. Damn. Okay, if you see a jump cut there, it's because he killed me again. <laughs> Okay, quiet on the set. My commentary is distracting me. He turned chicken. Shit. This is, I gotta do it this time. There we go for archery up to 80. There we go. Fuck, what a fight. <laughs> Damn, bitch. Now give it up. This is gonna be some steel plate armor. And archery up to 80, but I leveled up again, so I got a fresh set of skill training purchase rates. Or rather, I still have the ones from previous, which I'm gonna waste. So, let's sell off. Um, should be some good loot in the chest here. for the bear trap. Amran's family sword. Oh, it's not that good this time, but we do have the treasure map for. Well, let's go back to town and see what we can hustle up out of the loot that we got. See if we can at least buy uh, some skill training purchase rates or some skill training. And we'll get rewarded by Amran. He'll level up one handed and block for free. was nuts.
Okay, Adrian. Let's get to work here. Come on, let's go here. There we go. Okay, Amulet of Zenithar. On. Quick save. Got some good pieces out here. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I just remembered something. Oh no, I had the beast stone hooked up, okay. Got something for just about everybody in here. Do you have a hot everything's for sale, my some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. I think I'm gonna have to blow off the skill training purchase race for this round because I need to check what I'm gonna like be wasting other opportunities as well. Okay, so there's nothing here. Do come yep. back. Because I'm pretty sure one handed is close to leveling up, and I'm pretty sure block is close to leveling up as well. So I'm just going to blow it off. Points into magic are definitely, yeah, one hand is just short, and block is just short as well. So I don't want to waste those opportunities. And we have two skill points, two perk points rather. Swing it on over to archery. Did I pass it? Here we go. And get overdraw five. Now we're cooking with gas. Next, smithing. Let me just quickly take care of those level ups right now. Um, Back to the homestead. Mix it up with a couple of mud crabs. I forgot about the dragon. Um, Enough is enough. Let's go join the Dark Brotherhood and get the mark for Death Shadow. Oh, I can wait. How about the Mud Crab at Riverwood? Oh, enemies around here. Oh, wait, there should be some Mud Crabs around here. I hear one. There we go. Don't kill him, Thunder. I want to have my way with him. There we go, block. I am one handed. Great, mission accomplished. Calm down there, Thunder. Calm down. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's see if we can get far enough away. 
we uh, can wait. That means, okay, so let's go down to Falkreath. Ha! Hectic, eh? <laughs> and get on down to the Dark Brotherhood. There's actually, um, while we're here. Did you see a dog out there? No, I didn't. Some wolves, but no dogs. Oh, well. Yeah, I know about the blacksmith that offering a reward. And we'll keep our nose clean. Outside. While we're here, um, yeah, I'm just going to do a quick delivery for this guy. So I'll do that first thing next video. So I'm going to call it. Thanks a lot for watching. Was that worth the price of admission or what? Wow. Ah, yeah. Pretty hectic on legendary difficulty. My name is Major Slack, and I definitely approve this video. If you do too, please give the old Slacks their big old thumbs up, post a comment, and most importantly, subscribe to make sure you get all my videos hot out the press. All right, see you next time. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. All right. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.